so this is my iOS 14 page part one. So this time I'm gonna show you how to create and this is my iOS 14 page part two. I'm gonna show you how to create this. So yeah, let's get started. What smoking fireside gang? It is your boy Shama and get ready for another hot video. So for today's video, I'm going to teach you how to customize your iOS 14 homepage. Yeah, baby. But anyway, before we get started, please give this video a thumbs up and make sure to ring my post notification bell and comment below. Okay, okay. So the only thing you really need is the Widget Smith app and the photos you want to use. All right, so let's go ahead and let's get into it. And the first thing you want to do is you want to open up the Photos app. Okay. So we're going to use this photo. So you're going to turn around. You're going to press the blue arrow at the bottom. Once you press the blue arrow, you want to turn around, go to add to album. You want to name a new album. Remember this name, okay? Press save. Once you do that, you want to go into the Widget Smith app, okay? So you have three sizes you could pick from. You could pick from a small widget, medium widget, or a large widget. We're going to make a large widget. So first thing we're going to do is press add large widget. We're going to turn around. We're going to click on it, okay? We're gonna turn around, we're gonna click default widget. What happened? Did the app crash? Let's try that again. Okay. So basically, default widget. There we go. So then once you click on it, you wanna turn around, you wanna scroll all the way down to the bottom, okay? Click photo album, boom. You know, then turn around and click select album. Then you wanna look for the name we just named. So we name it Chris Brown. I so woke boom. Up Chris okay. You wanna press the back button. You want to rename it. And then you want to press save, okay? So once you do this, you turn around, you go back to your homepage, okay? You turn around, you hold the screen down. Yeah. You want to go and press the plus button. And then you want to turn around, go to search widget. Turn around, you want to type in widget smith. Boom. Then since we made a large widget, you want to go to large widget and press add widget. Okay, you see? Boom, baby, easy. Yeah, yeah, okay? Okay, now that's situated, we're going to go back to our photo album, okay? We're gonna turn around, we're gonna go to the next picture we're gonna be adding. So I'm gonna add this little picture, all right? So it's the same steps, arrow, add to album. We're gonna name it Moon, okay? Once that's saved, bam, baby, back to Widget Smith. So this time, we're gonna go and we're gonna make it a small widget. So we're gonna go, we're gonna press add small widget, click default widget, scroll all the way down, click photo album, select album, look for the album you just named, okay? Boom, Moon, back. Rename it. Once you do that, you go back to the screen. You hold it down. All right. You search Widget Smith. Add small widget. That's a picture of Oppa, you know, but we could change it, okay? So just in case that you get it like this, only thing you have to do is you just click the picture and then turn around and look for the name you just name it. Moon, okay? Then bam, baby. All right, so that's basically it. The only thing you got to do is just add some apps. I'll just add these for right now. Okay, and then I, uh, how I did it, I color coded it mine, so yeah, but that's how you do that one, okay? So let's go ahead and let's move on to part two. So this is design one, so now I'm going to show you a different way to design it, okay? So let's move on. So this is part two, okay? This time we're going to do kids name, code, kids next door code name, well, yeah, y'all yeah, know the name. What? Anyway, it's basically the same steps. You're going to press the blue arrow in the left. You're going to turn around, you're going to go to add to album. You're going to create a new album. We're going to name it um, Kids Next Door. You're going to press save, okay? You're going to turn around, you're going to click Widget Smith, okay? So you're going to go to add to medium widget, around, click it, click default widget, scroll all the way down, click photo album, click select album, and then you're going to look for the name. We name it Kids Next Door. Rename it. You're going to press save. You're gonna hold your screen down, add the plus button. You're gonna type in Widget Smith. This time it's a medium widget, so you're gonna press add widget. Click it, all right, then click it again and look for the name. Do this, we're gonna go right back to the photo album again. Um, it was a small widget, so add widget. Then boom. And then you're gonna add your apps in. And uh, so we're gonna add one more picture. So yeah guys, that's basically it. That's a tutorial on how to do it. I did mine. I know some people changed their like the logo, but uh, I didn't want to do that because like I'm very forgetful. And just in case like say if I'm in an emergency and say like you know like I, I need somebody to call nine one one, they have to look for my phone app and that's 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 too much. So anyway, so I just decided to color code mine instead of changing the actual logo. Okay, so I picked blue and I just picked like the blue apps, put that together. 
put all the green apps together. Please give this video a thumbs up. Make sure to ring my post notification bell. And yeah, and tell me what theme you're going with.